Ooh, that is a tiny box. Um, ah, it's gone bigger. Hello, guys. My name is Madrintino. Welcome to Lev Oma. I didn't say that right, did I? Levoma is what I'm going to call. Welcome to Levo. I don't know if that's right, but listen, we all know by this point I'm autistic with forwarding. I can't speak. I don't know how to talk, so that is okay. The point is, this video is another, yes, another, visual novel slash interactive novel. Now, as you, hello, car. As you know, I really do like these games. Yes, they're a bit of an easy video for me. I'm not going to lie. But at the same time, I actually really like these. I think they're fun. I, I genuinely think they're fun to read because I, I said it over and over again. I like the stories they present. You can present so many stories for them. They can be very interesting to just read and just kind of immerse yourself into the world so without further ado we will get into this plus it just looks really pretty too you know oh um i don't have a controller with me at the moment wait hold up hold up wait 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 i don't wait don't have a well i mean i guess this works too a mouse could work too i'd rather use a controller but you know what fuck it fuck it we don't oh are they all there granny all right there's no one else, it seems. That's good. Oh, wow. You could really move the entire... Oh, okay. This is kind of cool. All right. There's no one else. Nobody else, it seems. That's good. Perhaps for the first of the season to come mushrooming here. What do you mean by mushroom? I guess you would be collecting mushrooms for um, dinner or something? <laughs> um, I know I forced you a bit to come, and I'm sorry. But you look like you could really use a bit of fresh air. Uh, sure, little Timothy says as I turn the screen. Whatever. Let's get going. It's the season for penny buns, so you'll have to look for those. I don't know what penny buns are. You want to explain to me, Grandma? What the fuck is a penny bun? You want to tell me? No? Okay. If you don't recognize a mushroom, you find. fine. Just show me and we'll have a look together. Well, if you say so, Grandma, I'll take you. So, first off, I don't like the fact that you have forced me here. That is not cool. Okay, cut the music. Fuck you! I'm joking. I'm joking. But I do appreciate the fresh air. You know, don't get me wrong. There's a lot of times... Ooh. Thanks for coming, by the way. Grandma's not as flexible anymore. It's pretty tough for me to pick up these mushrooms. Oh, Grandma, you silly little hag. Why am I still in Grandma's voice when I'm talking to my voice? You silly, silly bag. Sure. So we seem to be the type, quiet type. Like, granted, don't get me wrong. Obviously, a lot of people, you know, they would prefer to, you know, take their time off and just, you know, not be forced to do shit, especially as a kid yourself. Trust me, I imagine there's a lot of times where I was forced to go places I didn't want to go. And I was being the brat, I was in the back like... <laughs> just being the pouty little shit that I was. <laughs> I'm sorry, Graham. I'm coming. I would be the pouty little shit. I'll be honest. A lot of times. But I am grateful that I did go a lot of times. You know what I mean? Just, I just... It, it's the fact that I, I'm an introvert. So, you know what I mean? I like doing my own shit. When someone tries to yank me out of my fucking area to make me do something I want to do, I'm just like... Fuck you. <laughs> like, the back of my head, obviously. Because some of the times I wasn't old enough to cuss yet. But, you know, then again... Like, like I, I started cussing in middle school, so I think it's normal. <gasps> Shroom! Grandma, I found one. One. So how many do we need, Grandma? Wow, you already found one. You're really taking this seriously, huh? Yeah, well, I mean, might as well, since we're here, might as well not be a prick. Not be a dick, you know, Grandma? To make a challenge. I'm not surprised you always like to make a challenge of those things. Um, no, 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 not me. Sorry, I think you're confusing me with someone else, Grandma. <laughs> don't worry, though. If you don't find enough penny buns, Grandma's got some ideas for what to eat this evening. Let's see now. What do we have here? Hmm. Well, it seems you're good with this one. Great job. Hey, but don't forget, if you're not sure if you have the right species, always check with someone before you eat them. Mushroom can be really dangerous. Grandma doesn't want you to get ill. All right, let's go look for some more. I mean, yeah, I, I no, no offense. I'm not really a big fan of, um, you know, just pulling shit out of the forest. Gratefully, remember when we came here when you were younger? To build huts and everything. I, I don't remember that, to be honest. That was a long time ago. I guess that's what you do in that blocky computer game nowadays with your friends, right? Minecraft! I don't play Minecraft too much anymore. I'll be honest. I've got burnt out. I play too much of it. But I love it. Good game. Good game. Good game. No, I don't anymore. Oh, see, you got burnt out too. You must have spent an hour. You must have spent hours long too. See, me and the kid, we, we think alike. We, <laughs> it's, it's such a bad habit of mine. Such a bad habit of mine. I would always play the shit out of any game. I remember like Into the Gungeon. I played that shit for a solid week. And not even a week. I saw a month till I got burnt out of it. Um, You know, Call of Duty Zombies. I love Call of Duty Zombies. But I played the absolute shit of it. I got like 900 hours in the Black Ops 3 alone. And then Minecraft, I have a shit ton of hours across all the fucking versions of the Minecraft. Because if you play it on console, there's multiple versions for some stupid fucking reason. But we ain't gonna talk about that. <sighs> Anyhow, let's have a look. Oops, that doesn't look crap. Why? Right? <laughs> Grandma, your English is slipping. <laughs> should be careful. People are gonna make fun of you for that. It's okay, Grandma. I won't judge you. That's not an edible mushroom. No worries, though. I'm sure we'll find more. I hope we do, Grandma. Alright. Let's look for some more of them. If you say so, Grandma, if you... 
You, you say so. Let's look for some more. Why she turned so fucking strangely? But yeah, it's always been a bad habit of mine. I played shit out of video games. I, I, I can't help. Uh, it's help, help. I think most people are in the same boat of me. Where it's like a new game comes out that you're excited for, you'll, you've been looking forward to, and you just play it, and you play it, and you play it, and you play it until you just don't feel like playing it anymore. I mean, I guess that's how it comes with any game. You want to just play the shit of it until you can't play it anymore, and you just want to have a shit ton of fun as much as possible. So you know, is what it is. Such a nice morning, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Wow, this place is. I thought it was starting dark. I'm gonna be honest. I thought we fucking failed. I thought Grandma was about to fucking whack us on the fucking head and be like, "Well, Sonny, we didn't find enough. You're a useless child. Get out of here. We can't make soup now." Or the penny buns, as she said. Penny buns. Penny buns. Penny buns. I still don't know what a penny bun is, Grandma. But if you want to tell me what a penny bun is, I'll be great. Such a nice morning, isn't it? Better early, I say. I actually like waking up in early. I'm gonna be honest. Like, <laughs> to be honest, though I am far, far, though I am looking far in the future of if I could ever make this a career, I like the idea of, you know, thinking of, oh, I see that shroom. Come to me, bitch. You're mine now. Grandma, Grandma, I got a shroom. How's it going, sweet? Having fun? Yeah, it's pretty relaxing. Now, if it's freezing cold, I'm gonna have to dock some points off of that. So, sorry, Granny, but that eight is gonna have to come seven. No offense. <laughs> Grandma's like, you little shit. How dare you! <laughs> in the back of my mind so how's your new room by the way oh it's nice you know it's um listen grandma i'm, I'm a bit of a perfect i don't know if you know this. i i got some stuff in it you wouldn't like i got some um i i must miss listen yes i i have some stuff you don't like grandma i'm sorry i don't want to be disappointed you you're degenerate you're dead to me grandma please no it's not grandma we can still talk about this it's okay grandma no get slapped boy where's the ruler no slap me no I don't know what I'm doing. I don't really care. Oh, we're that type of kid. What do you mean you don't care? How come you don't care about your new room? I mean, it's fine. I don't want to talk about it, okay? All right, then. What do we have here? Oh, that's also a penny bun. You're worried about these rotten parts, right? It's okay. Look, we can just remove this part and voila. Another one another one for our seed. Go us. All right, let's look for some more, shall we? All right, Grandma, if you say so. But yeah, I know I'm looking, um... Too far in the future here and then say hey, for all i know this probably will never be a career of mine but i like to think in the future you know making videos and i i like i like the idea of doing videos but also i like the idea of streaming like early in the mornings because i actually do like streaming i've streamed granted stream next to no one <laughs> but i like the idea of streaming i wouldn't mind streaming you know early in the morning getting me a cup of coffee you know be with the other early birds assuming you're in the same time so i mean you might be across the fucking world and be like n <laughs> fucking fucking night and be like what are you talking about it is night for me you fucking child but you know what i mean I, I like the idea of that i am sort of uh i like to say i'm an early bird a bird i like to think god my words i'm slipping on my tongue i like to think that i'm an early bird then again i i tend to be a bit cranky <laughs> from what i remember oh my god the amount of times i fucking <laughs> my fucking mother oh someone's cranky this morning i uh, listen so i'll be honest i like waking up in the morning but i will admit if you talk to me within the first like 30 minutes of when i wake up i'm gonna be a cranky motherfucker <laughs> and i'm gonna not be happy so <laughs> it's like i like to think i'm an early bird if you give me like 30 minutes to not fuck off yeah i mean 30 minutes i'm oh, sorry if you fuck off for 30 minutes i, I can be rather nice <laughs> That sounds so bad. I'm a nice individual if you don't fuck with me for 30 minutes. Then we can be friends. If you fuck with me for 30 minutes, I'm gonna tell you to fuck yourself. <laughs> I hate the same it. I'm cranky. Where's my coffee? You okay, sweetie? Well, I haven't had my coffee, Grandma, so I'm a bit cranky right now, but you know. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, Grandma, look, another penny bun. Hope it's another penny bun. Sco score one for us. Let's see what you have here. Oops. That doesn't look quite right. That's not an edible mushroom. No worries, though. I'm sure we'll find more. All right, let's look for, sir, for, let's look for some more of them. This isn't bad, though. This isn't bad. I, I actually generally do like walking. I do a lot of walking, granted. Like, 100%. If I, um, 100%. God, my word. I'm still tripping on. One day I won't mumble, guys, but you're gonna have to deal with the mumble like that I is in Magic 18 for the time being. But generally speaking, I actually really do like, um, walking. I, um, personally speaking, for me, if I have a lot on my mind or if I'm feeling a bit down, a bit depressed, I generally do, um, a bit of walking because it kind of just helps, clears my mind to say the least. You know what I mean? Like, like, I mean, I, I don't, I don't want to sound depressing here, and I don't want to ruin everyone, anyone's mood. Granted, it's my video, so I'm gonna do what the fuck I want, and you're gonna deal with it. <laughs> but aside from being an asshole, I like walking. It's um, it's nice. It, it helps me clear my mind, listen to some music, maybe preferably some Skyrim music. Granted, I played some of the OST of that song a thousand times to the point to where it makes my fucking ears bleed. But hey, that's just my fucking issue, isn't it? Why near a stream already? I see. I wonder if we'll get to see the blue heroine we've always seen around here. I don't know if that is. I guess you mean bird. It is really pretty. I like the style of this game. But yeah, I just like walking. It, personally speaking, for me, like some people like driving. Some people like walking. Some people just like 
reading, which I like doing that too. But I mean, like I just, it helps um, clear my mind. You know what I mean? If you ever want to clear your mind, maybe try walking. You know what I mean? Unless you don't like walking, you know, because you're lazy. You fat fuck. I'm choking. That's a joke. Calm down, guys. I'm not trying to mean. Hmm? Were you talking shit again? Were you fat shaming? You little shit. I thought I warned you about this. Grandma, no. I'm not being rude. Grandma. Do you sense anything? Weird. Usually we see the blue heroin around here. Hmm. Maybe it left for the winter. Yeah, you're right. Maybe went on vacation. <laughs> or died. I'm just kidding. I'm not trying to ruin the mood. My blue heroin, I assume they're referring to birds. I don't really know my animals too well. I mean, I don't. I didn't wait. I didn't go to like biology class. No, I took biology class. That has nothing to do with it, though, but... <sighs> you're saying people already got their mushrooms here. I can't see any facility. We're probably too late already, Grandma. Don't give up just yet, sweetie. Grandma sure will find a whole lot. If you say so, also that's strange. The way she makes a sound is that um she makes a sound that a bunch of mushrooms grow here, and then people come and just yoink them, essentially. So I guess hmm, is there no like local store in this area, or is this more or less like a tradition thing? Like you know, it's a tradition to go out and find all these pennies, buns, penny bun. And then you like, you know, make your home. I assume it's some sort of tradition. Cause it's the way the kid made it sound. But anyhow. So, tell me what's going on. It's nothing. Sweetie, listen. You know, Grandma knows you since the very moment you were born. I can tell my sweetie's struggling with something. It's just, it's only been a few months since we moved. I'm always losing sight of my friends. I just miss them a lot. <sighs> yeah, moving sucks. It's not the funnest in the world, but we still chat regularly. Well, that's good. That's the price, right? But it's really not the same. Don't you play that blocky building game when you're with them anymore? With them anymore? As you used to do? Well, it's not as fun. Now I'm not around and stuff. There are new in-jokes I don't get because I missed something that happened offline. Things like that. How about your new school, though? Have you made any new friends there? Yeah, I'm sure you make new friends, right? It's not all doom and gloom. I had to miss the first month of school because of us moving house. So I don't feel as though I'm really part of my class. I kind of feel like I don't belong there, I guess. Hey, that's fine, man. People will come to you. For people who don't know, just a side note. I have actually gone to different schools. I went to three different high schools. <laughs> Not the funnest experience, but I mean, the downside being with the kid experience, which I get it, you know what I mean? Um, for me, personally speaking, I, I lived in my neighborhood for such a long time. And, you know, having to move the first time around and leave all my friends behind, it did suck. <laughs> it, trust me, it sucked. I went to that high school for like two months and I had to leave. It's been my birthday move too, that was shitty. But it, it does suck having to leave behind friends you've known for such a long time. But I mean like, you'll find people. You know what I mean? I, when I went to my second high school, I wasn't there at the beginning. And you know, I kind of just did what I did, but the teacher was really nice, the principal was really cool, and there were people who just attached to me. I remember during the cafeteria, I just went to the table in the corner, because I was like, you know what, I don't want to treat anyone to be rude. I, you know what I mean? I'm just like, sick myself and just chill. And then some people saw me, like, oh, hey, you knew, and they pulled me into their group. And they were really kind and sweet about it, and really nice, and it was, it was cool. So I mean, like, you might be a little late to the, you know, the race, sure, but there'll be people who will pull you in. I'm sure of it. Don't worry, kid. And that's what Grandma wants you to realize, right? Have you told mom and dad about all this? Probably not. <laughs> I don't really want to talk about it with them, if that's okay. Sweetie, of course that's okay. You know I worry about you, and since we don't see each other often, I worry even more. If you tell me what's going on, I can maybe help you. So thank you for telling me about this. And that's the thing too, even if, technically speaking, she can't help you with, um, you know, your feelings and that. I see this mushroom, come to me, bitch. But there's a shroom here, Grandma. There's a shroom. Add it to the collection. Let's go. Grab you, even if she can't help you, with your problems, you know, like I said, just having someone listens, having someone listen, listens, <laughs> listen is nice and it helps you to some degree, the side of very least. But, ah, uh, what's this then? Ah, uh, this one's a bit too spoiled. I don't think we can eat it. Don't worry, we'll find plenty more that'll be taste, that it'll be tastier. Let's see what else you found. Ah, what's this then? Oops, that doesn't look quite right. It's not an edible mushroom. No worries, sir. I'm showing if I'm more. Ah, damn it, man. I keep finding all the bad shrooms. I'm finding all the ones that are poisonous. Are you trying to poison Grandma, Sonny? No, Grandma, no. I will get the rule again. Don't make me beat you. No, Grandma, no. Don't do it, Grandma. I've been a good boy. <laughs> Uh, as you can tell, I'm having a lot of fun. I love video novels, man, or interactive novels. I, this is the reason why I love them. I love just being on the fuck around. Even if the game kind of does 
you know, play the game for themselves. You just read the dialogue. I like to just make it shit up. It's really fun in my mind. Oh. Oh. We're a grown adult now. Holy shit. Oh, wow. And it's winter. Oh, that's pretty. If I had to take a guess, not be a downer, but I assume we're in the future to where Grandma has sadly passed away and is not with us anymore. And we are now coming here more or less for, I would assume, not for the penny buns. Penny buns. But we are here to, I guess, take a shawl down memory lane. Well, it's never fun when people pass away. I haven't experienced it too much. I've only experienced two losses, sadly. Or thankfully. I should say, not sadly. Thankfully, I've exp <laughs> sadly experienced two bodies. Not 10. Not 20. Not 100. But thankfully, you know, haven't experienced too much. But it does hurt, I guess. Well, might as well go down the road and see if we can find any penny buns. Not in this weather, I assume. Those look really lovely. I love the winter, bro. Winter can be a bitch because it can be very... Are you approaching me? I'll leave you be, buddy. Don't mean to intrude in your land. Have a good one, buddy. And, um... Have fun. Yes. Oh, my phone. Hey, Grandma. Oh, she's still with us. Okay, she hasn't passed away. Oh, that's good. Hi, sweetie. How's it going? I'm fine. Thanks for lending me your car. I'll be home soon. Good. Did it still drive okay? Uh, sure. It's a bit cold, though. So, it took some time to start, is all. I went to the forest where we always came to pick mushrooms, you know. Ah, great. It's been a while since we did so. But with my leg, I can't really come, right? Well, tell me when you come back, okay? Sure. Bye. Bye, Grandma. Talk to you soon. Yep. Bye. <laughs> okay, bye, Grandma. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Trying to say bye and just keep saying bye back to back. That's really funny. I feel that. That's really funny. Oh, that's so sweet. That's so sweet. Oh, oh, that's oh, I like this. I like this. I like how they're doing this. This is really cool. How about we get a nice cup of chocolate milk when we get back home, okay? Mm. I prefer coffee. Mercy speaking, even as a kid, I prefer coffee. But you know what? Chocolate milk sounds good too. I ain't gonna judge. I ain't gonna judge. Oh, I'll, I'll take that. Ooh, shroom. Grandma, look what I found. Ah, uh, what's this then? Oops. Damn it! When are we gonna find the right one? Grandma, how many more? Are you holding something? Are you lying to me? Do you know the secret to the shrooms? Because I don't. God damn it, man. I can't find the right stream. They all look the same to me, bro. How can you tell? They look the same. Let's just take it. Fuck it. We'll gamble. If one of us dies, it's okay. We'll die together. We'll fucking Hunger Games this shit, bro. We'll eat it together, die together, and then, you know, well, we'll go to heaven. That's, that's, I'm, I need to shut up. That's not cool. That's not cool. <laughs> Ever since the forest fire five years ago, they decided to actually take care of it nowadays. Oh, well, that's nice. I mean, it sucks that I took a fire to make human beings give a shit, but... That is nice, Lise. You might not remember it, but this place used to look a lot quite different. But with time and care, the forest became healthy again. And now people can hardly remember the way it looked back then. Funny enough, actually speaking, we, I, I remember in my fucking neighborhood. In the neighborhood I lived in as a kid. I remember the, we used to have a giant forest in the neighborhood, like right behind my house as well. I remember they cut it up. And it, it was so strange, just like seeing the forest that used to be there and then seeing it all cut up and chopped. It's so strange. It's like, I remember the forest being there and now it's just like gone. It's like, God, it's so weird. Granted, we still had a lot of fucking fun messing around with the um, piles of wood. And I, um... <laughs> My dropped my old um, phone, my old fitty sh shitty phone, down the pile of wood, and oh my fucking god, bro, I had such a panic attack, because I'm like, <laughs> like, imagine one of those small flip phones, and you just drop it, and it just go, ding, 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 down, like, a pile of wood, like, <laughs> I fucking panic, I was like, oh, fuck, I fucking digged down the entirety of the pile, went all the way to the bottom, grabbed that phone, the moment I grabbed that phone, I was just like, oh my god, bro, the fucking heart attack, I was like, <sighs> I was like, oh, god, man, <laughs> so scared, but... Uh, ah, that's also a penny bun. Yay! Play the victory music. Da -da 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 -da. We did it. We found another one. Oh my god, I was losing hope, Grandma, but <laughs> you were worried about those wrong parts, right? It's okay. Oh, yes, I know. You can remove them. Same old, same old, Grandma. We got three. How many do we need? I swear to God, she's like, we need ten. I'm just like, oh, <laughs> she's like, play the sad music. Oh, really pretty game. I like the style of this. It's really cool. It's really cool. I like the gra- I like it. I like- I like these styles. I- am gonna- I say this in every video. And guess what? You're gonna keep hearing me fucking say it every video. Cause I need dialogue. <laughs> I need my dialogue. But yeah, really cool graphics. It's really nice. <sighs> this is a massive fucking force. <laughs> Holy shit. How long does it go? Grandma, how long do we plan on walking here? You don't know, Chad. But once we reach the dead end, 
It'll be a dead end too! What do you mean, Grandma? What do you mean? I'm gonna kill you, laddie! It's over! Oh my god, no. Oh, oh my god. What's up, sweetie? Hmm. Mom's room isn't done yet. Well, we can help with that, you know? I don't mind making rooms. I'm assuming it's not dirty as shit, but I mean, hey, if her room's not done, that's okay. We can help fix it, right? We can move where the shit is. Granted, oh my god, man, moving shit is so exhausting, though. <laughs> when we just arrived, she said she was going to sleep in my room until until her hers was done. But it's been months, months now, and the workers aren't coming the workers aren't coming any longer, so I don't think her bedroom will be done anytime soon. Because of that, because of this, I can't put all my stuff in my room, so I had to leave things with Dad in the old house. Uh, I'm sensing the divorce then, the way that sounds. <sighs> divorce sucks too. God, there's a lot of shitty things that can happen in your life, you know what I mean? But it's unfair that I can't have all my stuff in my room because they were fighting all the time. I'm missing my friends, had to miss the first day at the new school, so I don't know anyone. Mom wakes me up when she goes to bed too late. It's not cool that they do this to me, I think. Mom says she'd be grateful for the things we have, and she is right about that. But all, my, all I have is my friends and dad being at the other end of the world, slowly forgetting about me. Sweetie, they won't ever forget about you. Don't worry, it'll all be fine once the dust settles. In the meantime, I'm here for you. You're doing amazingly well, you know. Despite what you're going through, it'll all turn out fine, you'll see. Come on, chin up, sweetie. Let's walk to take our minds off of things a bit. See, that's what I mean. You walk a bit, it helps clear your mind. But yeah, divorces can be shitty. Moving can be shitty. <laughs> Life is full of a lot of shitty things, you know what I mean? That's why I'm grateful for a lot of things. I'm grateful for music. I'm grateful for games. They, you know, I'm grateful for being able to just go for a walk. It's like small things like that. They may not seem like much, but they help you in the smallest ways possible, would you believe? And even if you're struggling through hard times, it's okay. Give us some time, like Grandma said. Once the dust settles, a storm will be coming, and y'all be in for the real treat now. <laughs> oh my God! The dust settles, a fucking hurricane comes in. Oh no, sweetie! Round two. <laughs> get me. Life sucks. There's no other way around it. But trust me, just give it time. You'll go through some pain in the short run, but trust me, in the long run, you'll be a lot better. And um, you'll be grateful. Trust me, you'll be very grateful. Would you believe it or not? <sighs> But anyway, seems like we're back to the, seems like back to the, um, you know, forefront of the ground, that is. I really like what they're doing here. I think this is really cool. Transitioning from childhood to adulthood. This is really cool. I really like what the game's going here for. It's really nice. All right, Grandma, come on, call up. I know you want, you know, you want to talk to me again. Come on. If you don't call up, I'm going to throw this phone in the fucking woods and then say, fuck it. Okay, come on, come on. Call up, Grandma, Grandma. Don't pick up the fucking phone. <laughs> God, man, this is such a... This is long. I mean, granted, I can't be mad, you know. These types of games are pretty long for a reason, but... God damn it, it just keeps going. <sighs> I love the smell of the pine forest. It might be one of my favorite smells. Reminds me of the pine honey you have at home. Definitely the best honey in my book. Yeah. Trees are really pretty. Holy shit. I wonder if this is all in the same time. I feel like this is multiple um, trips, to be honest. Just because, I don't know, the way it seems... Oh. We're nearing the lake, it seems. Well, that's nice. Lakes are pretty beautiful. Up and down to that, Grandma. No wisdom. Okay. But yeah, from the first forest to this forest, it just seems like it's multiple trips, just because of the fact that the, so the it seems like we're going through the different seasons, because before it seemed like it was in the fall, and now it seems like, oh, well, I'm going to shut the fuck up. <laughs> we're back in, you know what? I'm going to shut up and not talk. I knew, I I mean, don't get me wrong, the whole, you know, the whole thing of, you know, the, the, I'm, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna sh not talk. I'm gonna not talk. The game just told me to fuck off. The game's like, oh, 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 you think you know better? You think you know better? Oh, no, 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 no. Let, let me tell you to shut the fuck up because right here, we're gonna prove you wrong. So, <laughs> fuck's sake, man. Remember when I told you about the day I arrived in the country for the first time? Yeah. Before I arrived, I'd never seen any snow in my life. Bro, I, my friend Gamer can relate. My friend my friend Gamer has never seen snow. I remember fucking my friend Ging's like, bro, there's snow in here. Gamer's like, I've never seen snow. <laughs> it just sounds so depressing. <laughs> oh my god. At least I've seen sm snow because I used to live in North Carolina and now I live in Texas. Even if we don't get snow in Texas, I at least know what it looks like. But fucking Gamer, <laughs> I've never seen snow. It's like, you fucking asshole. <laughs> when I grew up, the only place you've seen around snow was in the crushed ass with some sugary syrup. So... 
When I arrived here, seeing all the snow everywhere around me, Grandma totally couldn't resist eating as much of the icy sweetness lying about everyone. Okay, Grandma, hold up. Hold up. I understand you want to, and I might have did that as a kid myself, not gonna lie, but we shouldn't be doing that, Grandma. That's not good for you. That's not good for you. <laughs> so what happened? Well, I got sick and died! I'm gonna stop. Well, obviously, I had a stomach ache for days. So that was my introduction to this cold, snowy country. After I got better, how ever how? However, ever how? What is wrong with me? I didn't lose my appetite for some nice ice cream once every so often. And slowly, with time, I learned to live in such a different country. Made new friends. And I even met Grandpa here. Well, that's nice. I'm sure you'll be able to find your place in your school. Might take some time, but you'll get there, kiddo. Don't worry. Just give it some time. I'm sure you'll find some friends. Hopefully some good ones. Not some assholes. Like I am. But, you know, hopefully you'll find a place. Might take a bit of time, might take a day, a week, a month. But once you find your place, I'll look better. And then you'll look at your grandma and you'll be like, Thanks, grandma. And grandma will be like, <laughs> I told you, you little shit. Did I? I told you. I told you. Ooh, what is this? Oh, is this like a little viewing dock? Oh, this is nice. <laughs> a little window for Shorty and a little window for Tolly. Well, this is nice, grandma. What do you got to say about this? This is where you die. Prepare yourself, child. Bring the sword. Slash with me. I'm gonna stop. I, 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 I'll honestly stop. Well, we reached the bird watching cabinet. Shall we head back? Do you think we have enough mushrooms? Let's see. Seems we only found three, but that's okay. With this, we can make a nice risotto. Nice. Yes, very nice. And then we're home. I'll chop you one by one, throw you in a stew, and cook you alive! <laughs> I can't help it. I can't fucking help, man. I can't help, man. Uh, let's home. Let's head home, man. <laughs> I, can't. I can't help it, man. I can't help it. Oh my god. Well, this is nice. I don't know if this is the end of the game, or there'll be a little more dialogue going along. But this is really nice. Like I said before, I like this sort of whole idea of moving back and forth between the winter and the summer, between like adulthood and childhood. It's really cool. It's a really cool perspective. I don't know if I've seen that. I want to say there are other games that have done this. I don't know if this is the first in its liking. Probably not, because it's very hard to make an original game nowadays. But this is really cool. Like I said, graphic wise is pretty pretty. And I love my snow. What can I say? Snow is so beautiful. I fucking love seeing it. It's just it's phenomenal. It's it's fucking great. Ooh, there's grandma. Hey, Grandma. Hi, sweetie. Are you okay? I'm fine. I'll be coming home soon. Oh, okay. I'll start no way. You don't have to go. You don't have to, though. I'm doing fine. Well, I'm just not used to you driving, you know. Well, get home soon, okay? I'll make you a nice cup of hot cocoa. Awesome. I'll be right there, Grandma. Yeah, I'll be right there. As soon as I can. Be never! I'm just kidding. It's a joke. In honor of my grandmother. My grandmother. Oh. Well, that's sweet. I assume your grandma is still alive to the death. I, I hope she's not passed away. But if she is, so sad. But that is nice. Game Bly 4 8, Or, I'm not saying names. Kind of put your names, man. But that's really cool. That's really cool. That's very sweet. That's very sweet to know that you made this game. This entire game just for your mother. Thank you for playing. Thank you to the people organizing the Wild Rumpus for encouraging me. Oh. Thank you to everyone helping me by playtesting the game and help me improve the experience. Playtesters are important. <laughs> Special thanks to Alice Pesley. Don't know what you did, honey, but sure you important to some degree. <laughs> I'm being an asshole. I apologize. And extra, extra special thanks to you, <gasps> me, <laughs> for spending some time in something I made, and it really means a lot to me. Aw. Well, it was a cool game. This game is a tribute to the people who give us the time and space we need as a child. Aw, that's really nice. I hope I didn't just skip the entirety of that. Oh, shit. Was there more? I really hope there wasn't more. Oh, I would feel so bad if there was more and I skipped it. Oh, no! <laughs> Well, I hope I didn't just fuck that. I really do. If I just fucked that and it was more, I do apologize. I'm so sorry. But I'm not going to go through the entire game and again just for that. I'm so sorry. But like I said, this, that was really sweet to make a game for your grandmother. As well as the fact that just, you know, because I understand there are people in your life that are important. Whether you want to think, whether you believe it now. You know, I understand as a kid, it's very hard to, um, you know, see that people do genuinely mean the best for you. Sometimes it's hard to see for that, especially if you're going through something as hard as a breakup. You know, parents-wise. Of course, not a kid. <laughs> not a fucking kid. Especially if your parents are going through a divorce, you know, or a rough patch. The people who are always there for us, they, they always do mean the best. And I'm sure they're always, you know, 
Just... I'm fine words. I'm fine words hard to find right now. To be honest. What I'm trying to say is, it's very sweet that you made this for your grandmother. And I understand that there are a lot of people in our lives, whether we realize it or not, who are very important to us, mean a lot to us, and are looking out for us because they hope the best for us. They wish the best for us. And it's very sweet. But, yeah. Let me know down below what you thought of this game. It was very nice. Very sweet. Like I said, I love these type of games. I just think they're so fun. They just, they always tell a cool story and I like to experience them. And yeah, without further ado, my name is Imagine Teen, and hopefully I see you guys in the next one. Have a wonderful day, and yeah, that's it. No weird intro this time. I'm making a weird because I'm not saying shit. <laughs> Bye, guys. Have a fun time.